In Firewatch tonight, crews continue to battle five wildfires, which combined are being called the Virginia Mountains Complex north of Reno. Uh, together, all five fires have burned about 50,000 acres. A better mapping actually reduced that acreage earlier today. Containment on all the fires is at 35%, with full containment expected by Saturday. The largest fire is the Thule Fire. That one's burning along the west side of Pyramid Lake. And that fire forced about 600 Sutcliffe residents to evacuate over the weekend. But now that power, water, and sewer services have been restored, many of them are returning home. Paul Nelson has their story from Pyramid Lake. Fire crews continue to battle the Thule Fire in the mountains north of Sutcliffe. And after two days of uncertainty, residents are returning home. Fires out north now are not in danger anymore. Everyone's safe and accounted for, so it feels really good to be back home. It was a different story Saturday when flames came dangerously close to town, forcing evacuations. It was intense. I would never have imagined we'd have to evacuate the community and be in fear of all of our homes. This house is serving as a place for residents who need supplies. Donations have been coming in from all over the state and many are being handed out here. We set up at my son's and um, tried to feed the firefighters and tried to provide a base for everybody that needed, um, you know, donations, assistance, lunch, food. You can see just how close this wildfire came to this neighborhood. A dozer cut a line where it stopped the fire and a plane dropped retardant from the air, saving these homes but leaving a big mess to clean up. Cyrus Davis Jr. is doing his best to clean the pink mess off his house, something he doesn't mind, saying he would rather be doing this than digging through charred rubble. Worth it. Well worth it. I don't care. I'll keep doing it. <laughs> I don't care how long it takes. We ain't got no water pressure, so it's really hard. So it's doing it by hand. Miles of hillside were burned, as well as other property like these cars. You know, one permanent home, three mobile homes, two vehicles, and then the big thing for the tribe was the tribe lost the uh, historic Hartscrabble Ranch. Meanwhile, Pyramid Lake remains closed to the public. Ash is washing up on the beaches, and helicopters are using the lake's water to fight the fire. I know it's 100 degrees out there. People want to go swim out the lake. It's just not a safe situation. Please stay away because it can interfere with firefighting operations. Covering Firewatch, Paul Nelson, Channel 2 News.